In Notion, you have these nice looking collapsible lists here, which we call toggles or toggle lists. In Notion to Anki, you can create flashcards from these. But what if you wanted to use this in regular Anki? How would you go about doing that? Well, we're going to take a look at how you can do that in your existing cards. So if we go here in my Anki, I have um, a deck here. And if we go into that deck, you see it's a basic question. And then you have a lot of text. So the way we're going to do this is by hitting the E button here to edit. And then here in the field we want to change, you just hit the shortcut for opening the HTML editor on Mac OS, it's shift command X, you can see you get this. So it's kind of messy. So before you do that, ideally, you should in here, just create your structure details here details. And that's the whole toggle list. And then inside there, we're going to create a summary. So let me just show you how it's going to look like. So summary here. And uh, let's say read more. And then the more text close. So you can see if we look at it now, nothing really happens. So the way what the way to get it to work is you're going to cut this text, go into the HTML editor and then paste this because this is actually code there. And then you can see we get the toggle list and it also works here in the reviewer here you can see there. So let's open that up. And then um, we're going to take this text cut that out and then enter the ed HTML editor and then we'll paste our text here. Bam. So if we look at it now and click read more, you can see we have our text here. I'll have a link to GitHub so you can copy paste the code snippet and then use it in your setup. Uh, thank you for watching and make sure to like and subscribe.